Hi guys, bienvenidos a mi canal. Today I'm going to be watercoloring the sketches that I'm doing for the Shrek painting that I'm doing. And I said doing two times, but whatever. And by the way, if you hear like these sounds, it's because I'm sitting on a ball. According to my chiropractor, supposedly because I paint a lot and sew a lot and I'm always sitting and because I use my arms a lot, it's bad to sit on a computer chair for a long time. So he recommended me to get a exercise ball to sit on. You might think I'm bad, but he told me the exercises to do, but I kind of forgot what exactly to do. I should probably Google them. So someone asked me, do a small painting of Shrek Swamp. They want it like a very glamorous, girly swamp. So I am your girl to do this. Thank you for the opportunity, the person that ordered this. And yeah, I'm just hyped to do it. So I'm gonna show you guys what I came up with. I have like all a couple inspiration pictures over here. Um, I even did them here. And they're black and white because I don't have because I didn't have um, color ink. So the drawing that I made is kind of like a quick drawing so she kind of has an idea of what is my vision. It's gonna be brick, <laughs> French fancy iron on the staircase here, nice door, the little patio, maybe like a French iron inspired table with seating area, maybe cherry blossoms at the back. I'm thinking of adding glitter because the sunlight is going to be directed from this way. There's going to be butterflies, a little fairy. You see that little fairy? Yeah, it's a fairy. So the size of the canvas that we're going to paint later on after I do the sketches is six by six. And it's like a thick wooden stretched canvas. So I want to present her a couple ideas for this before I actually start painting on the small canvas. I have like three different colorways that I think would look nice and I'm gonna leave it up to her. I'm going to be using artist tape on the edges of the square that I drew, um, which is the same size of the canvas. And I'm doing this so the watercolor doesn't bleed um, out of the edges. You know what I've been wanting? Those donuts from the mall. They're like really small sugar donuts and they have they make it in that little machine and they flip it Yeah, I want those donuts right now. It's probably really bad for you, but they're so hella good I'm gonna go to the mall just to get donuts <laughs> Who does that? Me, I do them. Look at what Melissa got us And then here's the donut place I'm talking about And we're gonna get donuts Whoa, buddy and these are the donuts that I'm talking about. The little stand is called um, Mini Donuts. Nice. I wrote on them what color combinations I'm gonna do for each of the papers. I think we're gonna do them all pinks and purples first. Okay, in the first video that I ever made on this channel, I mentioned about using the little storage bin that I have like this, where I place all my art stuff and it's clear on both sides. And what I do to make it like kind of like a light box because I don't have a light box, I put the phone in the center with the flash on and then you close it. This is how it's gonna look. And then I'm gonna tape it from the back. And I'm doing this so the, so the pencil markings doesn't show on the actual sketch paper. Making sure that the corners are lined. All right, so now that's that. I'm gonna turn on the light, but just know that you can see right through it. you guys are bad bunny fans but soon we have to get on the computer and get the tickets they are gonna go on pre-sale today at 12 
so we gotta i already have the computer ready hopefully we get tickets i hope they're not too freaking expensive and i hope i get good seats this is gonna be like my first concert that I, of artists that i do like because the only concerts that i've been at is because of my parents i don't know if you guys know um the band mana and we've been i think at two concerts that i remember it, it was so long time ago and with that being said this is gonna be like my first ever concert of a artist that i actually like and the bad bunny concert is scheduled to be next year on march 10th which is his birthday and that is so crazy that he's coming to my city on his birthday birthday next year. We're on here at Ticketmaster to get tickets for that party. And so far, this is what I have on. Because there's like so many people wanting to purchase them, they open up another day, which is March 11th. And, but on this one, oh my God, wait, hold on, what? Oh my gosh, wait, what? Thank you for your patience, it's almost your turn. <gasps> or it says, thank you for your patience. Uh, okay. I can't even talk. <laughs> oh my god, I'm gonna cry. No, what? Are you kidding me? Jose. It turned me out. No way. Yes, look. <laughs> They're probably sold out. Are you kidding me? Okay, let's not be sad. Okay, so this is for March 11. Uh, Are you kidding me? Wait, can you show it? Can you show it? Clap it up. So guys, we actually... Oh, wait, hold up. Guys, we got the tickets. Ah, I'm excited! So I don't have it here because Jose got them, but we got them around here and we're sitting. This is the stage and we're going to be around here. Ah, All right, guys, so we finished this up now i have to kind of out make the outlines and then it'll finish up the sketch for this one i'm just going to be using artist loft pens point one and then i have the artist loft illustration pen point three this is how point one looks and this is how point three looks i'm gonna just start with the lavender all i'm really doing is like little tiny kind of hearts and i'm trying to do that as fast as possible Alrighty, on to the next one. Oh, I was thinking of doing lives on here on YouTube. Um, I don't know if you guys would be interested, but I think it would be kind of cool to talk to you guys while I paint. And then you guys could ask me questions, or you can even like paint with me, whatever you like. We could do. So I'm going to show her these two and see which one she likes. If she doesn't like any of these colorways, then we're gonna have to work something out. Comment down below which color combination you like. I will post the final Shrek Swamp painting when I complete it. So be on the lookout for that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and learned something new and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.